one of those two ends is going to be out of balance. Car and wall turn two. Yeah, here we go, guys. I mean, this is Jimmy Johnson. Johnson. Yeah. This is what happens to this racetrack, and this is what we were talking about with Jimmy. It's so hard. Hey guys, we'll back up. See if we can get a replay. Yeah, I didn't see it start. Uh, when I saw it, he was already up and in the wall. Here you go. I think it got loose on getting yeah. in. He had to chase it up the racetrack. Ran out of real estate. Well, this is the this is the part that I think they may have underestimated a little bit with being able to to come to the racetrack and drive these cars. They take such a different driving style than the cars that, that Jimmy used to race. As yeah. soon as he lived out of the gas, came around on him, got loose. And, and, and the, the way that you correct the cars, the way that they feel, the things that you have to do in this car to keep the car from spinning out, they happen way different than the old style car. the start that he wanted no and it's just a it's a it's a tough box that that jimmy's in having to come to these racetracks like this to do these races and and try to get up to speed in the car and get the feel for the car because you're just going to be behind all the time whether it's in the steering or uh, being comfortable in the car whatever it is he's just going to be behind the whole time the whole aero platform I and mean, i saw him back and you know as as he's backing in look at the difference in a quarter panel versus what he used to, to be in, right? A lot of, lot of quarter pan, a lot of side force action that we used to have with these race cars. And this, and you know, the underneath looking, body of you're these looking at, You're looking at Kyle Busch's car. He races every week. Yeah. And one of the most talented drivers you could ask for in anything that, that has ever driven. And he spun out on his own. It tells you how easy these cars are and how edgy they are to drive. Two cup champions with a combined 11 wins here between them, though none in the seventh generation NASCAR car have both been in the wall asking for backup cars, and uh, Kyle Busch has been checked and released at the Infield Care Center. Well, yeah, this that's is a just seven time winner in this sport and cup, Jimmy Johnson. I mean, that guy is a bad man. It's just behind any experience with this race car, just like you say, Kevin. And Kyle Busch, who does really well at this track and won here last night, has more laps on this track this weekend than anybody else in this race. But these 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 cars are not those cars, and it just takes a totally different.